yeah, it's like a light. It goes so good with your dress. It's so pretty. Rhonda. What? What'd you eat? Kim, that was not me. What? Jeepers, are you ladies okay? Like you look like you saw a g g g ghost. Right, bro. Let me at him, let me at him. Uncle Ruby and I will give him something to be really scared of. Well, I'm sure there's a logical explanation for all of this. This sounds like a mystery we can solve. Okay, Shaggy, Ruby, Scrappy, you guys run inside the station where you'll obviously encounter the ghost and run away scared. We'll set up a trap outside that you'll accidentally stumble into. Like, no uh -huh. way, man. Uh-uh, no way. Would you do it for some Ruby snacks? Okay. Like, man, there are some times I'd do anything for a Ruby snack. <laughs> Ruby, Ruby, Ruby. <laughs> Uncle Ruby and Scrappy Ruth are toughest mutts around. We'll find this ghost and pound and pulverize him. Like, man, it might hear you. <laughs> Ruby, Ruby, Ruth, where are you? We got some news for you now. Ruby, 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 where are you? We have some clouds in view now. You know that Rhonda has that fashion sense, and Casimir has got his ass got wrapped. That's a fact. Kim is the brains of this whole operation, and Jason's got that shaggy stash. Who wants snacks? Ruby, 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 we found you, and now I get the feeling that since the weather's cool, as a crew, we should all go trick or treating. Jinkies, I think I solved the mystery. <gasps> A local four news reporter, Nick Monticelli. Always here, I never get any sleep. And I would have gotten away with it if it weren't for you meddling kids. Joinks! He's almost as scary as a real g -g ghost. <laughs> Big thanks to Doc Sweet's Candy Company in Clausen for the candy machine. And Kari Hobbs for our wonderful music, Jinkies. And to my dog, the real Ruby Roo. And a big thanks to you at home for watching. Happy Halloween. All right, man, can we get something to eat? Uh oh <laughs> <laughs>